Child, what is in the air today? Clearly, these girls need a vacuum because they are being messy. Well, it all started after Nikki's ex-hairstylist, Khalil, commented under a blog which posted Offset's lawsuit with quality control, in which Khalil commented saying, One thing about them tables, child. Well, of course, Cardi B caught wind of that after her fans tweeted, This little jailbird is obsessed with Cardi. Don't you have bigger things to worry about? Then Cardi B replied to her fans saying, Nika couldn't even afford Bill. First thing he comes home is to my dick. Child, Khalil replies to Cardi saying, I wasn't even eligible for bail, dick sucker. You are obsessed with me. Imagine sitting at home, mumbling and cackling while your man was in my homegirl face last night at the Hollywood event. Imagine being so obsessed with all things Nicki Minaj that you stalk her fans too. Khalil then goes on to tweet Nicki lyrics. These now they ain't Reebok, which is a jab at Cardi B's shoe collection. Mmm, child. A Cardi B fan replied to Khalil, you probably can't even afford no Reebok considering you have to steal. Which led to Khalil saying, meanwhile, your fave is associated with the biggest scammer in NYC, please. Oh, and I am Cardi B? When you gonna run Rachel and Sarah they coins? No, they're not gonna settle for the four mil you keep trying to offer them. So stop ducking them court cases and pay up. Child, Cardi B then says, First, you claim I offer girls 4Ms over a case that the state pick up, which is illegal. Then you claim I'm trying to make mans with no receipts. Then claim my man was in your friend face with no receipts. Now you lying to go viral. Why are you lying on me and those girls for? I have an open case. Everything is public. Offering money will not benefit me and actually get me in real trouble. You making up anything because you decide to come for me? after coming out of jail for stealing 3k worth of clothes laughing my ass off now you know you offered them girls the money and please don't ignore my other tweets how many outfits t styles done stole from you how many chanel she blipped girl cardi we still in outfit show khalil then goes on to tweet 3k worth of clothes laughing my ass off where is she getting all this the deflection is insane but we not gonna ignore offset at john wow's house last night in my homegirl's face khalil dropped some receipts of cardi b calling t styles to have her retract the statement of making up with nikki shall wait so cardi was trying to make up with nikki minaj to <laughs> after throwing a shoe at our girl cardi we need an apology a public apology so you didn't so say, say this on the side, side. Like, like, I'm going to stand up, bitch, I'm going to start lying. lying. I wouldn't, I wouldn't even, even, like, like, we, we say, say some shit like, like, like that, that if it wasn't, it wasn't true. true. We were here within the club, we were here within the club, we were having a conversation, but it was no conversation where that Cardi wanted to watch my people. Yo, I swear to my, listen, 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 listen. We sat down, we had a conversation. You was talking to him, you was like, yo. Cardi would be willing to go on some girl power shit, they both knew your shit gotta stop. This is exactly what you said. This is exactly what you said. And my mom was like, yo, Cardi, you know what I'm saying? 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 You got people defending you, but the fact is you spilling your client's tea with your besties, hoping you get some tea off of me. You unprofessional, but want to go out in front for people that would drag you if I really talk. Cardi B tweets about Casil's charges saying, 3K worth of clothes? Baby, it's in your records. Fuck you mean where I'm getting it from. Everyone was at the party, including my cousin who's a set assistant. Just like you lying about that four mil, just like you trying to make your fan put words in my bitch mouth. Now, after Cardi B said that, Khalil ended up showing a list of photos of Offset's mugshots and tweeted, Now we know you love a good piece of jail dick. Let's not get high and mighty, Miss Billy Brim Blood. Nobody put words in Styles' mouth. She knows she said it. You want to make up and that's cool. Why cap? Everyone was at the party except you. Yes, he was in my homegirl's face. I hate a snaggletooth, worn out sex worker who sucks dick for success, makes a couple dollars, and starts filling her pussy. Can't stay in a basement, ass shot having, over lip sunction out female who is so insecure she pumps her face every few months trying to look like someone else. Keep calling me a thief when your friend sold Yandy Smith fake Chanel bags and took her 7K. You might want to check your authenticity, babe. 
which led to Cardi B throwing jabs at Nicki's husband because Khalil doesn't have a husband. So what husband could Cardi B have been talking about? And then she tweeted, Ooh, my man got a couple weed charges and gun charges cause he ain't no pussy and was a hustler. Rather dick slinging than taking pussy from bitches. You wanna bring up my nigga up trying to get me mad? Let's not talk about husbands now. Khalil then corrects Cardi as he tweeted, Sarah and Rachel that money. Laughing my ass off. It's been two hours. Why are you so mad? You did try to make her mans. That's why you cut styles and knew exactly what I was talking about. Offset deaf fuck sweetie though. Ooh, child. Even though we spilled that tea about a week ago. Anyways, enough of that mess. Cause Missy Elliott felt the need to shade Nicki Minaj after she got her Billboard Hot 100 hit with Super Freaky Girl. But pause. Cause why all of a sudden these girls want to shade Nicki? Like give my girl her flowers. Just because Nikki is at the top right now, and she has the best fan base, the girls just can't stand to see her win. Anyways, Missy Elliott tweeted, I have a question. Is there a difference between a hit and a classic record or no? And if so, what is the difference? Now, Missy, you know you could have just congratulated Nikki. But anyways, somebody tweeted, Elliot at her big senior citizen age is too old to be sitting around being shady towards Nikki for absolutely no reason other than her being friends with Lil' Kim. Been in the game since before dial-up internet and you asking what a classic hit is. Now, somebody else tweeted, Missy, you haven't had a hit since George Bush was in office. Also, Please stop with the classic record talk because your music sounds like any other outdated 2000 songs that nobody will ever play in 2022 as a classic record. Being shady isn't going to help your career at all. Now, all I know is I don't want to hear nothing from nobody when Nikki finally comes out and blasts everybody for being shady to her just because she sits on the top. But the tea does not stop here. Check out our other videos and get you a second cup because the tea never stops.